vectors P R and S Q determine the diagonal of a parallelogram P Q R S. If P T is this vector, then we have to find the volume of parallelo pipe formed by these three vectors P T, P Q and P S. Now this is one of the easiest problem from vectors and 3D. First let us draw the parallelo pipe to form by these vectors. Let us say one face of this parallelo pipe is PQRS. In a parallelo pipe, each face will be a parallelogram and this angle is not necessarily 90 degree. Now here vector PR is given and SQ is given. Let us call this point T. So this is our vector PT. Now we have to find the volume of parallelo pipe formed by these three vectors PT, PQ and PS. Now let us call these vectors as A, B and C. Let us say this is vector A, P, S, this is vector B and P, T, this is vector C. So we know that volume of a parallelo pipe whose three coterminous edges means three sides starting from the same vertex. If they are vector A, B and C, then volume of parallelo pipe is A cross B dot C. And obviously we will take magnitude of this quantity because volume is always positive. Now this is the formula when the three coterminous sides are given, right here we are given two diagonals, each face will be a parallelogram. So for one of the face PQRS, instead of two sides, the two diagonals are given. So in that case, the formula for volume of parallelo pipe, this is half of D1 cross D2 dot C, where D1 and D2 are these two diagonals. For example, D1 you can take PR and D2 you can take SQ. Right, so this is the formula for volume of parallelo pipe if diagonals are given. So here vector D1, this is PR and similarly vector D2, this is vector SQ and vector C, this is another vector PT. So now we have to find the scalar triple product of these three vectors and then volume of parallelo pipe will be half of magnitude of a scalar triple product. So now let us calculate the scalar triple product of these three vectors. Now all the three vectors D1, D2 and C are known. So this will be their scalar triple product. And after simplifying this determinant, you will get magnitude of this quantity as 10. So therefore the volume of this parallelo pipe will be 10 units.